Hey y'all, swamps and marshes are found in almost every Louisiana parish. So come with me as we explore Audubon Zoo's tribute to the Louisiana swamp. From uptown New Orleans to downtown in the French Quarter, meet the real wild animals of New Orleans. Brought to you by Audubon Nature Institute. Bobcats, otters, and gators galore. Welcome to the Louisiana Swamp Exhibit. It's unique in this country. Nobody else has a Louisiana Swamp Exhibit. And because it really epitomizes what southern Louisiana looks like and feels like. We tag along with Audubon Zoo staff as they prepare for the day. Our adventure begins deep into the exhibit, two stories underground to be exact. So we are under the swamp exhibit right now. Yes, we are underneath the swamp building and we're heading downstairs into the otter den. So this is where the otters sleep at night? This is, this is their night den. So good morning, boys. Up the ramp and out into the exhibit they go. He's so cute. Here you go, baby. He's always waiting patiently. Oh, he got it. <laughs> From adorable otters to another swampy creature who loves the water, we head inside to check on the white alligators who have a rare genetic condition which gives them their pearly white complexion. Trainers scrub down the glass walls of their exhibit twice a week. So this is what you clean the exhibit with? This is exactly what we clean the exhibit with. This is our special aquarium glass cleaning magnets. We've got a scrubby pad on one side. This goes on the inside of the glass. And this one right here goes on the outside of the glass. And what happens is you just move this one and this guy follows. Meanwhile, their relatives in the lagoon aren't as tidy, but just as huge. And these five alligators are hungry and ready to eat. You signal the gators that it's feeding time by hitting the pipe on the thing. The vibrations transmit through the water and then whoever's hungry is right up in front of you. Oh my word. Here you go, baby. Ah, oh my word. Wow. You can really feel the force in their jaws of their bite. Like a giant shish kebab, the gators have a pallet for fresh meat on a plastic pipe. With the help from Audubon trainer Tim Borgart, you're like the gator whisperer. I find out just how hungry these gators are. Woo! Oh my goodness. While the gators like to be hand fed, the bobcats enjoy more of a challenge when it comes to eating. They have night houses that they spend the evening in and then when they come out in the morning they really enjoy hunting for treats in the exhibit. And this bobcat found our camera mic particularly intriguing. The bobcats aren't the only furry friends who love a challenge. Armed with a bucket full of fruits and special bear biscuits, Aaron and I hide food before the bears enter their exhibit. It's a daily routine that keeps the animals and trainers on their toes. You have all kinds of ways of climbing up and hiding treats that are just out of reach, just out of sight. So the bears have a good time and it usually lasts for a few hours until they find everything we've hidden. As the busy morning at the Louisiana Swamp Exhibit comes to a close, it's time for a little rest and relaxation. Well, at least for the animals. So the next time you're at Audubon Zoo, make sure to stop by the Louisiana Swamp Exhibit. And while you're here, check out the gator feedings. For a complete schedule, log on to audubaninstitute.org. <laughs>